The Book of Mormon really, just from the beginning, is moving quickly. So we're in Jerusalem okay. at this point, and we're in Jerusalem at a really particular time. It tells us in chapter 1, verse 4, uh, that these events happen in the first year of the reign of Zedekiah, king of Judah. So that's a whole story. Okay. Um, if you go to Jeremiah chapter 28, that's interesting background reading to get a sense of what this world is like. The Babylonians had just come. They took away the king of Judea, but they left Jerusalem standing, right? And so in Jerusalem, there's this big division between people who think that this is it. They've been delivered. It's gotten as bad as it's going to get. And Jerusalem, the city where God's temple is, can never be destroyed. <laughs> and so a prophet named Hananiah is the advocate of that group. And then you have a prophet named Jeremiah uh, who says, no, this is not what's going to happen. He sees the writing on the wall. The people haven't repented. And he says, Jerusalem is going to be destroyed. It's going to get worse. So in chapter one, Lehi prays and decides what to do and has a vision. And these chapters detail the vision he has that Jeremiah is right, that destruction is coming, and that he needs to get his family out and prepare for life away from everything they've ever known. <laughs>